Hello everyone and welcome to the next Building Endeavour video. Welcome once again and uh, if you are following these videos thanks for your support and thanks for watching and do remember everyone you can leave a like and hopefully subscribe to this uh, channel, it's free. Uh, now this week's video we're going to concern ourselves with the foremast. I've got the chart behind to help me get the measurements just right. Uh, so let's get into that. Right, we'll start with the lower mast of the foremast. This is a, uh, a 10 diameter piece of dowel. Uh, it has to be shaped though. Um, at the top end it has to have a square section and then it has a gradual taper out to the uh, full 10 mil diameter at the bottom. So uh, let's get on with that. Okay, so I'm just going to mark out the uh, limits of the top square section that has to fit, it, fit into this block here. So if I just mark it roughly there, okay. So I need to make a smaller square section. Let's do that. Alright, so that's the lower foremast according to plan. Now to do the next bit, which is the top mast, and it has to be shaped down to around about 5mm at this end from 8mm. Uh, I need to cut it in length and start sanding, so let's do that next. Okay, I'm happy with how the four top mast has sanded down. Now to cut and sand down the four top gallant mast, which is the very top one here. Let's do that next. sum that down next. Okay, so I'm fairly happy with this top gallant mast. I just need to cut out this cap here uh, just to check that this size diameter here will fit around about here. Uh, and then I can make a necessary adjustment then at this stage. So I'll do that now. 
right, so far so good. So now I have to make um, a receiving peg which will take the top of the uh, foremast here and then a tiny peg at the end to take what's called the uh, topmast truck which you'll see in a later video. So I need to make a rounded um, diameter peg here and there. So let's do that next. So there we have the four mast, the four top mast, and the four top gallant mast. They're not glued, they have to now be stained. So we're going to do that next. Alright, so I'm happy with that as it is. So next we're going to construct the foremast platform and the bibs that go below it. Uh, and then that should be it for this week's video. Okay, let's get on with that. We have to cut it from this pre-cut piece of um, Seppley wood. parts cut out. Now I have to glue these together and clamp them up. Okay, so these are the braces for the foremast top, and uh, now I need to put this little small cross brace in here. So let's just do that. Using white glue at this stage is much better than CA glue because CA glue is just a little too aggressive. Oh, so what? Let's put some down the side as well. Nice contact there. Okay, just line that up on the squares. Oop. I'll pop it up. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so while I'm waiting for some of the other things to dry, I'm just going to put these uh, cross struts underneath here. Okay, that's one. The other one just goes across exactly the same way. Of course, you can always just cut it just a little bit longer than necessary and then sand it back. So just done there, just a little bit. All right, so there's the glue glue on there, and we'll glue that on there when it's dried. While I'm waiting for that to dry, I just need to do the uh, top mast, uh, top, what's this called now? Uh, yeah, the four mast top gunwheel. 
and the foremast top gun side. Yep, so let's put these out. Right, that's that one, and two of these as well. There we go, that's one, and the other side. Oh, ah, I'll trim it up in a second. Uh, and then I'm going to drill these holes as well as marked. Uh, yeah, we good? Yeah. All right. So we'll do the rest of that on time lapse. Hmm, I think I need my magic wand. Let's be clever and build Endeavour. Ah, that's a lot better. Okay, well that's it for this week's video. Um, in next week's video we'll continue to make more of the components for the format and then get on to assembling painting. So, until next week's video, Please do leave a like and subscribe and bye for now.